cierre de puerta. Tan, tan. In Spain, with the twins. And it's crazy because everything here in Spain is literally, it's almost half the price of how much it is in France. And I'm only here for a couple of days, but I think we have enough food to, I think we have enough food to, we'll be alright. And more coming. <laughs> Uh, but I'm gonna have to help them, so we're gonna spin. We got the whole outside part to ourselves. Okay, so we're here. I wonder what they're going to get. <laughs> if you guys are new to the vlog, they usually get the same thing every time. I think they're ordering for me. Car c'est pas lui, c'est toi. T'as faim? Tu viens de de l'apéritif? Ah, si. Perfecto. Gracias. So this is like a classic Spanish kind of meal. We have like the ham, ham, cheese, with bread. With this stuff, it's like patatas bravas, where it's, that's like, uh, it's like french fries, but cut up like this. With some sangria. And we're waiting for paella right now, which is super Spanish. You can typically find it more on the cities next to the beach. Like here in Valencia, Spain, it's right next to the coast, so you'll find a lot more paella than you will. Get out of here. A lot more than you will in other places in Spain, for example. I mean, normally you eat it on the beach, it's the best place, but it's okay here. À côté de la plage, quand tu vas à côté de la plage, manger la paella, des fois tu peux te faire avoir parce que c'est pour des touristes et du coup c'est moins bon et c'est plus cher. Oh. She's saying like next to, it's better to not get it by the beach because when you get it by the beach, it's not as good and it's made for the tourists there so it's they make it like however they don't really care and it's a lot more expensive when you come to a place like this it's a lot it's a lot less expensive if they really care when they make it and yeah it's better this is what I'm talking about <laughs> are you guys happy now yeah. <laughs> no 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 wait 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 <laughs> No! <laughs> Normally this is not in this. But they are they're French, so they they ask for this in their separate. No No! No! Oh my god. Oh yeah! <laughs> Well, well, what do we have? <laughs> twin one, twin two. Same thing. <laughs> okay, I guess now I can really say welcome to Valencia. <laughs>
so we've eaten so much food. Oh my goodness, it's hard to even walk around this town. Uh, we have something planned. We're going to like an escape. Hey, what's the name of the place we're going to? Yeah. Wait, clue, clue, enter. clue enter. Clue, clue enter. Some kind of thing like we're gonna be like FBI agents trying to track the criminal or something like this. Not sure. So we're trying to escape. Il y avait un mec qui c'était un chimiste et il a préparé une espèce d'arme terroriste pour détruire le monde. So we're like Jack Bauer, James Bond, however you want to look at it. <laughs> That's who we're gonna be. We have one hour, so we're gonna like kill some time. Thank you. <laughs> and this, and this is not the Spanish way, walking around in the south of Spain with Starbucks coffee. This is like the American style way. See, they're trying, they're trying to be like me now. <laughs> okay, we are almost here. This is the place. Clue Hunter. So we're about to start yes. now. So I'll see you guys at the end. We solved it! We solved it! Let's go! We got it. We had like you have 60 minutes, you have to get it done. We got it done with like eight minutes left, so many clues. This is the best place to come to in Valencia. If you're looking for a challenge, correct? <laughs> This place was so cool. So basically they put us inside of like a laboratory and inside the laboratory you had all these clues you had to find. You had to use a periodic table. There was a computer. You had to look in drawers. You had to get clues to open up things, to find things. Everything was a clue in there and you couldn't overlook anything. Like one of the most coolest places I've been before. So like I'm saying, this place. If you're looking for a challenge, come here. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. This is uh, your investigator's level. Pues muchas gracias. Trop fort. This is so cool. This thing was so cool. Like, I wish we could have filmed. I wish we could have filmed it inside because it was awesome. Like, it was so, oh my gosh. And the whole time you're doing it, you have like a counter on the wall that's counting down. Like, did it. You have 60 minutes to solve the whole thing. And so you, you feel that pressure and they make the, they play the scary music. You have the clues and, oh man. We did it. <laughs> And actually we're super excited about about solving that puzzle thing. We don't actually we're not actually sure what we're doing next. So I'm just gonna show you guys around Valencia. Ooh, okay, we've been walking around this town for like about an hour and a half. Time to get some food and maybe chill and just relax for a little bit before heading out later tonight. So I will bid you guys a good night, good morning, good afternoon, whenever you're watching this. Welcome to Valencia. <laughs> Hope you guys liked it and always remember to work hard, be brave. And don't forget to smile. <laughs> they get me every time. Ciao. Oh. <laughs> Doucement Non Ah voilà